And of course, we can't forget about our community events. Then this weekend is the Taste of Fort Collins. So let's talk about some food. Joining us in studio, Big Rob from 99.9 .9 The Point. Tell us more starting with the food part of this festival. Oh man, if you're a food lover, clearly I like me some snacks, right? You're gonna love the taste of Fort Collins. Um, all kinds of local vendors, local restaurants, some of just local food trucks. Uh, one that I can't wait to see at the Taste of Fort Collins every year is Biggs Meat Wagon. I'm sure you can imagine what Biggs is serving up. He does this, uh, it's like a, it's like a grilled cheese, but he puts like the meat inside of the grilled cheese. Oh, my mouth is watering already. So all kinds of different genres of food, um, all kinds of things that maybe you've thought about trying around town that you've never got to try. You get to do a taste, you get to do the full, like the full experience, the full meal. So. The food is definitely the main attraction at the Taste of Fort Collins, this long-standing Northern Colorado tradition. So, And of course, there's Fort Collins beer there as well. Oh, yes, but there this is. festival is also a major fundraiser. Tell us more. Yeah, so Kiwanis is, uh, is, a, is a group in, in Northern Colorado that we've partnered with for many, many years. Uh, and the, these, the coolest old folks you ever meet running the Kiwanis group, they come down, they serve up the beverages. So uh, take care of the Kiwanis folks. If you're coming to Taste of Fort Collins this weekend, um, Kiwanis is a, a huge part of making this thing tick and making the Taste of Fort Collins run as smoothly as it does every year. Um, but no, it's a, it's their, I believe it's their biggest fundraiser of the year as well through the Taste of Fort Collins. So. And of course, you're here from 99.9 .9 The Point, so we can't get you out of here without talking about no, music. Tell us about the lineup. We are so excited. This year we got the All-American Rejects, uh, which is going to be their Saturday uh, with Chad Tepper opening for uh, the All-American Rejects. So the Rejects are getting ready to kick off a big tour. Uh, they ho This will be their first show in six months. We were talking to them on the air yesterday and uh, they're super pumped about it. Then they kick off a show that comes back to Denver. So you get to kind of see the the, f the first and six months All-American Rejects. They have hits for days. Chad Tepper's a newer artist. He's so much fun. If you follow him on social, he's got like over a million Instagram followers. He's hilarious. And then on uh, Sunday, I mean, Dave Chappelle fans, we all know Lil John. you know, shot, shot, shots all night long. So uh, we're going to be getting it on all this weekend. It's probably our best lineup ever. The uh, weekend pass is completely sold out. There are still single day passes that are available and you get that. It's at tasteoffourcollins.com. Perfect. Big Rob, thanks so much for being hey, man, here. Thank you. The Taste of Four Collins runs all this weekend. Denver 7 is a proud sponsor. We'll be right back.